Former presidential spokesperson to Good Luck Abel Jonathan on New Media, Reno Omokri has urged authorities in the Nigerian army to use the case of a female soldier, Private Sofiata Kinlevy who publicly in military uniform accepted a marriage proposal from a National Youth Service Corps member at the National Orientation Camp in Yikpata, Kwara State to promote love and boost troops' morale against the army plans to penalize the female private soldier. Reno Omokri in a statement yesterday asked if it is not madness for the Nigerian army to be seen rehabilitating Boko Haram terrorists and penalizing a colleague for accepting a marriage proposal from a Corps member. Nigerian Army through his spokesperson, Brigadier General Oniema and Wachuku had confirmed the arrest of the female private soldier. According to Punch newspaper, Brigadier General Oniema and Wachuku said the private female soldier goes against the Army's social media laws and other rules and regulations in the Nigerian Army. Some of the rules of engagement in the Nigerian Army said Private Sophia Akin may be allegedly violated include, not due for marriage, romancing in uniform publicly, absent from parade, unprofessional slash indisciplined behavior, doing other things outside of her job description at the NICE camp, disobedience to standing order of social media rule and disregard of Nigerian army professional ethics. Reno Omokri citing a case of Turkish soldier who proposed marriage to his girlfriend during oath-taking ceremony, said the Nigerian army should have promoted the love story between private soldier Sofia Akinlebi and the NICE member as a recruitment tool. This Turkish soldier proposed to his girlfriend during his oath-taking ceremony, and generals of the Turkish army got up and clapped. Meanwhile, the Nigerian army, that is currently rehabilitating Boko Haram, is penalizing Private Hannah Sofiat for accepting a proposal from a corper? Is that not madness? The Nigerian army should have promoted the love story as a recruitment tool. They should have brought in the cameras and celebrated the couple. It would have built morale but instead, they chose to punish love, Reno Omokri said. Picture shows private female soldier, Sophia Akinlebi locks lips with a National Youth Service Corps member after accepting a marriage proposal. Many Nigerians have continued to condemn the army authorities over the arrest and detention of the private female soldier, saying, the constitution of Nigeria which supersedes the code of conducts or professional ethics of the Nigerian army guarantees freedom and liberty to associate. Osazuwa Akanido reports that the ethics or internal policies of many organizations in Nigeria do not conform with the 1999 Nigeria Constitution, giving the organization's opportunity to oppress and intimidate workers or staff excerpt those who decided to take the organization to court. Kindly support our vision of building a community of one million pen soldiers whose successes will be judged based on positive development in the society. Nigerian Army Arresting Female Soldier for Accepting Marriage Proposal is Madness, Reno Omokri December 22, 2021 Former presidential spokesperson to Good Luck Abel Jonathan on New Media, Reno Omokri has urged authorities in the Nigerian Army to, hashtag North is bleeding, killing 45 farmers, injuring scores in Nasarawa is heart-wrenching, Buhari December 22, 2021 President Muhammadu Buhari has described as heart-wrenching the mass killing of 45 farmers and injuring of scores of other, I reject new electoral act due to insecurity, cost, Buhari December 21, 2021. President Muhammadu Buhari has given reason why he refused to assent to the newly passed amended electoral act by national, hashtag North is bleeding, PDP did nothing to combat bandits for decades, Buhari December 21, 2021. President Muhammadu Buhari has blamed the past ruling political party in Nigeria, People's Democratic Party for doing nothing to combat. Video, I want to be closer to God, dreaded Edo chief tax collector Tony Kabaka goes to church December 20, 2021. Tony Adun well known as Tony Kabaka, a dreaded motor park, bus driver and bike rider tax collector in Edo.